What's up, what's up? Good morning guys, how y'all doing? So as you guys previously saw for the Subi, we went ahead and did a build breakdown. We took everything off. And uh, today we're gonna be go ahead and attempting to install these uh, GPI silicone uh, coolant hoses. It's like a full kit for the car. So let's see how it goes. All right, so first we're gonna start off with this hose right here that goes to your intake. So you guys see it has that little bend. Um, I believe it's this one right here that looks like this and uh, we're gonna install it so pretty much just uh, pull this guy out and these aren't hose clamped they were on with zip ties you want to do the same all right so now that that's installed next we're gonna go over here so you guys see there's two hoses we're gonna remove this one that comes up right here this is called the intercooler pipe gonna want to grab this piece that looks like that and install it the OE hose clamp doesn't fit so we're just gonna have to all right, so next, there's this little hose that connects to the coolant reservoir. The clamp. And this is why you replace these, because this, this just ripped off. Now we take this one. Pretty much the same thing. Just slide them on. But pretty much your two of your longest hoses, which are these guys, are going to connect to your overflow. The little L, which I'll link the photo right now, it goes right there. You have this like um, semi shape like that. Goes right here, zip tie here. I hose clamped it here, but you don't need to. This guy for our PVC from the top of your valve cover comes up right there. The super skinny long hose goes to <clears throat> the bottom of your throttle body, which I don't know if you guys can see but right there you see where the zip tie is that's at the bottom of the throttle body so you can install that over there and connect this to here and then i have this t fitting for the boost gauge but otherwise it'll come to here blow off valve and then same thing this one goes right there and then comes right there and it's zip tied now that's pretty much everything i uh, mocked up the inner cooler just to make sure everything fit but yeah that's pretty much it so next what we're going to do is we want to connect our water so we have our thermostat housing which i installed right now our thermostat and we have your two hoses we're going to go get our radiator too and for the radiator i had the stock radiator there was never nothing really wrong with it um but you know me i'm always looking online i came across this uh, beautiful Mishimoto oil radiator where it actually ended up being a really good deal and it was only 200 bucks so I said why not let's get it so we're gonna throw this in now connect the hoses and yeah that's pretty much how it does all right guys this is like a week or so later sorry i ended up catching a cold so i had to take a lot of time off recover but yeah the subi is pretty much a fresh new car we got the horns all the red pieces installed but our radiator that we talked about so you guys can see i did end up with this radiator having to not use this cover that was right here but um everything else was fine it bolted right up and uh, all the hoses you guys saw the big hose your two longer hoses rl this uh, 290 degree one and then <clears throat> we have ours that goes from the coolant reservoir to the turbo and uh, as well as the bottom for the turbo return for the coolant line I had heat sleeve, I went ahead and heat sleeved around it just because it's going to get hot and you don't want it to have any issues. And uh, our vacuum hose, pretty straight simple, um, but yeah, this is pretty much it. Now next we're going to have to throw on our, pretty much our cats in the car, but we have to throw on our up pipe, our headers and all that stuff and bring them up and uh, put our turbo in. But anyways. Hopefully this video helped some of y'all and uh, if you guys are interested in this hose kit there are 90 bucks comes with everything you need and uh, This stuff too. These were samples. We had custom like logo made so we can see how it is But I'll be offering these two very soon as well as those red side pieces So yeah, just stay posted same with the horn kits too if you guys want so I'll keep you guys posted on that But thanks again for watching. See y'all next week